Taking that gold card. Eight second window till that expires. Oh. Ignar. Oh, wow. Uh-oh. This could actually be very bad for Ignar. There's the exhaust going down right away. Stun, flash, pulverize, and goodbye, Ignar. First blood to crowd. Wow, that was some fun mind games right there. You definitely do not expect the mid laner to be in that brush at level one. They are definitely going to lose some CS onto Vayne, as you would expect, but here's Apple. Equalizer dropped, and that's the wind slash. Getting the execute onto Apple. Ooh. Being split pushing in the bottom lane, suddenly it becomes that much more difficult for IM okay, to fight. Okay, and there's an engage right there. Igar just gets destroyed. Chain CC'd by a great flash. Frozen down there, Kuve's in with his ultimate. Hopping around, but Tucson escapes through the tunnel. They're still gonna get a blue buff, however. Wow, that was a very sudden fight, but... ...line or not, is frozen. Didn't have the blue, he's down to about 100 mana. See there we go. Destiny activated. Who no is, way to choke this for all. Yeah, already there. Stun into stun. Nice chaining. Raw desperately needs a QSS, but doesn't have the damage necessary to do it. We're waiting to see if Annie engages. If that's going to be a Samsung engage. And Ignar going to drop immediately. Fury going to spell shield the Timbers, look like, on the backside. Tucson wants a flank right now, but that's not going to be an easy commodity. And there's another Miss Timbers, and Ignar just going to get Sivir ulted on and run over as Kuve shows up in the back line and executes Ignar. Twisted Fate, match the wave clear, and have to go impact. We're going to see the turret dive coming through. Yeah, Ignar just going to fall immediately right there. Gravity field not going to be enough to save him. And look at Kuve, he's still on the flank. He's looking for that engage. There it is! He's just going to blow everyone up. Waited very patiently to get in. Double kill for Frozen, but that is not going to be enough to save this game as the Super Minions tanking the turrets should mean a dead Nexus. Frozen is just cut off from this fountain right now. And is he gonna get through? No, Flash Fury actually dies. Impressive play from Frozen on the defense right here, but there's a Lich Bane and a Riven on your Nexus. He's gonna get another double kill. Is he actually gonna get a delayed Penta? No, not quite. Oh, well, oh. that's the end of the game, though. <laughs> Nowhere near. Kube already has his ult though. He's gonna walk into it. Evil Plate goes down. Kube gonna bounce to sit off with that arcade smash, but he's gonna die in the end. Popped for a first blood from Apple. Still going on here. We don't know how much longer the laning phase will go. No turrets down just yet. Fury headbutt Polf. Again, there's the Valk over the top, but there's not really much follow up. Fury has to flash. Flash from Tucson. Nice delay. And there's the Dragon's Rage into the kill. Roar will snag it at the end. It's felt like Samsung didn't really uh, actually go to contest that particular bit. They were happy to walk away. It seemed like Eve and Fury were in different ways. You're going to see the engage. The insect kick comes through on the crown. He's dead. And that's a TP for Apple as well. Samsung may be looking to re-engage. Kuve's here. Everyone under the turret. Big Hemo Plague onto several members of Samsung, but Fury still has that Trinity Force. He's still just firing those rockets, but it's just not enough damage. They get frozen, but lose even the process. And they're going in again. Tucson a little bit too deep. Roar with the finish out. Uh, however, more rockets. Apple trying to trade with his sustain, and they're going to get the turret, and not much more. Roar out of mana. Get Luna to safety. He was not. Interrupted right there. Kube wants to go on to Apple. Apple very, very vulnerable. And he's going to go down after using that Hemo Plague. Maybe eventually. Zonia's Hourglass for now. Tucson's going to get into the back lines. Chaos Storm on top of everyone. But Crown may be on cleanup duty. He's got the death mark. Samsung, Samsung can and should have pursued that. Five members, but that's because he's going to be giving up a dragon for this outer turret. And Tucson goes in right there. He overextends and it just explodes. The burst damage so high. Huge. They have a, a damage amp in the Hemo Plague and then so much from Victor. Their itemization is also coming along. Corky actually flash pulled, comes through from Ignar. Corky's very low, dies instantly. This looks like a good fight for Aya. Yeah, there's the colleague as well, Luna. Not gonna catch the tail end of it. There's a death mark on a roar. Roar will die in the end, but will crowd pay for it as well? Exhaust already onto him. He's on a bit of a run right now. Can he go over the wall? Yes, he can. Ignite ticks down, and that was a bit of a waste of a hemo plague there from Apple, actually.
a chance this crown wow. won't get there though well roar's not there either neither is ignar so they've got some time the apple taking a lot of poke damage right now so is eve taking damage from the baron luna on the outside fury's gonna get found by roar but they've got vision in the brush apple knocked around by the arcane smash luna in the back line crowd coming through crown with a kill onto roar and this is going to be samsung to clean up they got the skirmish they wanted and they got the poke double kill for crown we see. Oh, they're Righteous going glory. in. And TP activated. Apple's going to get there. They're going to try and collapse onto a flank. Culling really not going to do a whole lot. They are so scared of the Zed in their back line as well. They should be great positioning from Samsung so far. And there is Kuve just locking up a choke point with that Arcane Smash. And now the poke continues to rain in. IM has to walk around, but Kuve's there. Fury going to flash forward. Tucson is just CC'd in the back line and the Luden's Brox continue to come in onto IM. Frozen finds himself just CC'd as Crown looks to clean up. He will have to back off crit onto him from Roar. The super minions pushing out in mid lane. What does Samsung want to do? Seems like they want to fight. Well, Samsung just wants to poke, I think. Yep, that is a lot of damage for a jungler. And there we go. Apple is the first target. Has to pool to start off the fight. Luna gonna get low, but he's not gonna die to the Chaos Storm. But Kube finds himself hunted into the back line. Kube still gets the kill onto Victor. And Apple starting to turn this one around, but everyone's so low. The Pope oh. just destroys Roar. And as well as Apple's doing in the sustain, the Pope is too much double for Fury. And then Tucson on the run right there. Eve gonna. Oh, oh, oh. Uh. Ah. oh. oh. Yakety sex going on in the back line. He's gonna try again. <laughs> this is this is great. He sees Eve with that ward, so there's no way he's gonna get hit. But he's quite happy to just delay Lee Sin from getting back with the long death <laughs> time. He's cancelled with the pounce. <laughs> and Samsung Galaxy Monte Cristo defying all, I believe, analyst expectations with a comfortable 2-0. All two analysts on this cast did not think this was going to happen tonight, but Samsung delivers. They bounce back with their poke, and that's going to be GG. Clean, clean 2-0 for Samsung, especially that first game was really...